purpose is that this is our defect it is a irregular defect it is difficult to immobilize this particular defect and so we are going ahead with doing a tie wall drill in this particular fashion so what happens here is in this area in the center are the knots and the pressure is distributed in these areas so the pressure is distributed in these particular areas what happens generally is graft loss is there at the periphery so our focus should be that the pressure should be in these areas so that is why our tie wall dressing should be given in a different manner which we will discuss now so we we'll take these diagonally opposite sutures but we don't want to do that what we want to do is take sutures in this particular way so that whenever the knots come over here wherever the knots come those are the areas where there is maximum pressure of our tie wall dressing if we read to the inside 